What's going on guys? It's amazing why you're back with another video guys. Today guys, I'm going to be talking about how you can be getting gems from making food in Grand Cross. So let's get into it guys. All right guys, so cooking is a feature in the game where you can make food for any unit you want and basically they also have benefits to them. So specifically guys, if I were to make some um, Breath of Danaphore here with this, we can actually make some Elizabeth Affinity food. And so as you guys can see, the food that you make will have an affinity and it'll also have a battle bonus too. So for the battle bonus for this food, it's going to give you gold. But the, the thing that's really important here is going to be the gift affinity, guys. So when you go to your food, you're going to see a, a unit name. And so specifically with egg pudding, it's going to be Elizabeth affinity. And so what I can do here, guys, is I can make this Elizabeth affinity food and I can actually give it to Elizabeth for some gems. All right, guys. So when you go over to your characters right here, you're gonna have all your characters already and what you can do guys is you can go up to any character you want and you can check their affinity level so let's say this griamore right here guys as you guys can see i've already maxed out this griamore's affinity level but you can get to level three and actually get a diamond out of giving him food right so if we were to go to a unit that i don't have that on so let's just go over to like gallon per se so for gallon he is at level zero of affinity but if i were to make this food right here the bread and pepper and if i were to make about 30 of them you can get one gem which is really good guys if you're farming overnight with my my no stamina farming method definitely check that video out if you haven't already guys um you can definitely get a ton of diamonds over over time right so all right guys so if we go over to elizabeth right here so my sr my ssr blue elizabeth all right guys, so what you can do from here is you can just start giving the Elizabeth the affinity food that is meant for her. So it's for an SSR unit, it's gonna take about 40 of that of that uh, food guys. So if you have 40 of that food, you can actually just give the 40 affinity, um, the 4,000 affinity points right to the Elizabeth and you're gonna get the level three claimable item which is gonna be the diamond. So as you guys can see, depending on your box, you can actually do it for all your units. So if you have almost a full box guys, you can start to get a ton of diamonds. So if we calculate here, so with my box guys, I have 83 units in the game. So that means if I were to start making food for all of my units, I would be able to get 83 diamonds out of this, out of this method, right guys? So if I were to have um, all the units in the game, I would be able to do 88 diamonds from this method guys so definitely make sure you guys are cooking food in the game because cooking is a very important part of grand cross using this cooking method you can actually start to get a ton of diamonds for your characters so i hope you guys enjoyed the video just a quick one but it's definitely needed for anyone who needs diamonds right now so i hope you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to like comment subscribe as always guys and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out guys